The Nativity, illustrated by Julie Vivas. In the days of Herod the king, the angel Gabriel was sent from God to the city of Nazareth, to a virgin espoused to a man whose name was Joseph, and the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel said unto her, Hail, the Lord is with thee, blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled. The angel said, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favor with God. Thou shalt bring forth a son, and call his name Jesus. It came to pass that Caesar Augustus decreed that all the world should be taxed, everyone to his own city. So Joseph went from Nazareth to the city of Bethlehem, with Mary his wife being great with child. And so it was that, while they were there, the day came that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn son and wrapped him in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger because there was no room for them in the inn. There were in the same country shepherds in the field keeping watch over their flock by night when lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said, Fear not, for I bring you tidings of great joy, for unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign, ye shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts praising God. When the angels were gone, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go into Bethlehem to see this thing which has come to pass. And they came with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the babe lying in a manger. And behold, there came wise men to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he that is born king of the Jews? For we have seen his star and are coming to worship him. And lo, the star which they saw in the east went before them till it stood over where the young child was. When they were come into the house, they saw the young child with Mary his mother, and fell down and worshipped him, and when they had opened their treasures, they presented unto him gifts of gold and frankincense and myrrh. The wise men departed into their own country, and the shepherds also returned, glorifying and praising God for all the things they had seen and heard. And the child was called Jesus, which was so named by the angel before he was conceived in the womb.